all right what's going on everybody it's dominic here and today's video i'm going to be riding forest hill trail five uh, we're going to be taking the transfer section from sugar pine over towards china wall uh, it's the black diamond section of trail five it's pretty awesome uh, before we dive too deep into it though i just want to apologize in advance for some poor audio quality on this video my gopro 11 black microphone was starting to fail and uh, some of the audio is a little bit distorted so sorry about that in advance but hope you guys tune in watch till the end trail 5 is pretty epic um, this particular day i was struggling um, the transfer section on trail 5 is no joke um, but it's middle of june it's like 80 degrees not really that hot but it's kind of hot but my KTM 500, like, it was running super hot that day. I'm going slow, I'm working the clutch a lot. My fan is running nonstop. And uh, halfway through the trail, I was having a hard time. Like, the engine was vibrating a lot, and uh, it was losing power, and I was having to pull over a bunch. Like, there was a certain point through the trail, I didn't know if I was gonna make it off the trail. Um, I was getting pretty concerned. Um, I've ridden this trail before, but it was in the middle of winter where it was nice and cool. And the bike, although the fan was kicking on and off back then, like I was able to get through it no problem. But today, you know, it's a little warmer and uh, the bike was heating up pretty good. Like there was a point I thought the bike was gonna boil over or worse, I thought the engine could seize. But this section of Trail 5, um, this particular ride here that we're gonna watch, um, this is what prompted me to go out and do some upgrades to the bike. Um, right after this ride, um, I went out and got the new Takamoto Get SX1 ECU, and then I ended up upgrading the water pump on the bike to a Boyson Supercooler, and then I replaced the uh, radiator hose that goes in between the two radiators with the Samco T hose. And then I flushed out the coolant system and put twin air engine ice. All of that was prompted just because of this one little ride here. You know, I like riding tight single track with my 500, and uh, it's not really the most ideal bike for those situations. Um, it's more suited for open terrain, and I like riding the tight, slow stuff. So um, some upgrades were um, almost forced upon me, you know, because this is the type of train that I like riding, and uh, having a bike that's running hot and uh, losing power is not going to be an ideal situation when you're out in the middle of the woods by yourself. So. Um, Hope you guys watch till the end. Like Trail 5 is a pretty awesome trail. Um, this section here we're dropping in is the transfer section. It's Black Diamond. Uh, it's pretty rocky. It's pretty tight. There's some exposed sections, a couple rock climbs, a couple loose um, rocky sections. Like it's a pretty gnarly trail. It's pretty badass. So hope you guys enjoy the video. Um, thanks for tuning in. Make sure to hit the like and subscribe button, and then we'll see you in the next one. All right.
Walker. Almost had it. Oh. Ugh. 